Good day, good morning, welcome to you all. I am Father Roger and I'm so pleased to be with you this morning to welcome you to my church. Of course, you know that our church is named after a great saint right here, uh, Saint Marguerite Duville. Um, she is the first Canadian saint, so very significant. And you know what? Um, a saint is a person who is like a hero like a, a, a spiritual star. You know, it's like we have um, stars in, um, in sports. Well, these saints are our stars in the church, right? And they are persons who did wonderful things. They, they helped the poor and the sick. Um, they worked very hard to assist people. So our church is named after St. Marguerite. So she's very special to all of us. Um, I am Father Roger. As I said, I'm the pastor of the church and I really want to welcome you here today. Um, it's been quite a while. I remember way back in November, um, you came to my church and we had our first meeting and we gave you your very first book. Um, we prepare for reconciliation. And when I meet you next week, we're going to give you your second book. We prepare for um for the eucharist right so you move on to the second part of your preparation as we get closer and closer to your first communion i'm really looking forward to having you receive jesus for the very first time so this is a period of of preparation and reflection a time of prayer a time when we get to understand our faith a little bit better so next week Starting on the Tuesday, the 2nd of February, uh, St. John Bosco um, will be visiting our church um, and some of you will be receiving the uh, sacrament of, um, of reconciliation. You will be doing your confession um, for the very first time. So I just want to go over a, a couple of uh, things with you. Um, when you arrive at the church, an usher will be there to show you where you have to go. Um, we have three priests available, myself, Father Bernard, and the other Father Bernard, the older one and the younger one. So you'll be sent in, and it's all very simple. Don't get nervous. You already did quite a bit of preparation um, in the book as well. And you know that um, what First Reconciliation is all about. Sometimes we, we hurt people. Sometimes we do things that God is not pleased with. You remember on page 42, when you hurt others, right? It's not very nice. Sometimes we use very unkind words or we may tell a lie or we may um, be disrespectful to our parents or maybe to a teacher. And um, God expects us to seek forgiveness. And that's what um, First Reconciliation is all about. It's a sacrament where we are forgiven completely and it's completely wiped away so we don't have to worry about that and as you you learned on page 46 god always forgives us for any sin that we may have committed and you know when we commit a sin and god forgives us it helps us to be better persons to be more loving and more kind and to grow up as a child of god so you would go in um for uh, your first confession, you would make the sign of the cross and you would say, bless me, Father, for I have sinned. This is my first reconciliation um, and, um, and these are my sins. And then you would speak to the priest and tell him anything that you may have done um, that is wrong. Okay, it could be you told a lie, uh, you were disrespectful, um, you refused to, to help at home when you were given chores. Um, you, you did not say your prayers, whatever it might be. You go to the priest and then the priest is going to say a prayer with you and then you're going to say what is called an act of contrition. Okay? And the act of contrition, we have a, a, um, a little document that we will give to you and you simply need to read it off and then the priest is going to send you into the church. I'm going to do a little tour of the church in a short while and you're going to say a prayer and you're going to be all finished. So it's only going to take about five minutes um, and then you'll be all through and this is part of your preparation towards First Communion. So once again, welcome to all of you. God bless you and I'm really looking forward next week 
to meeting all of you and for you to experience the forgiveness of Jesus. Jesus loves you so much. He wants to forgive you so that you don't have to keep worrying about, you know, am I, am I forgiven by God? So take care. And um, the second part of the presentation will be a little tour of the church because I want you to see what the church is like. Okay, bye-bye. Amen. Okay, so here I am with my little friend and I'm going to show you how easy it is to do your first reconciliation. It's a piece of cake and, um, you know, you don't need to worry. And it's a very joyful occasion because Jesus is there to forgive us. Okay, so let's begin with the sign of the cross. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Okay, go ahead. Trust me, Father, for I have sinned. This is my first confession. Okay, and these are his sins. So at this point, he's going to tell me his sins. Anything that you may have done, you may have hurt someone, you might have been disrespectful to your parents, maybe you were a bit lazy in doing your chores, maybe you forgot to say your prayers, whatever it might be. And after that, I, I am going to speak with him and give him a blessing and pardon him of all his sins. So this is how I'm going to do it. Almighty God, Heavenly Father, we ask you to bless our brother, help him to become a better person, and pardon him of all his sins. I absolve you of your sins in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. And then he's going to say the act of contrition. Okay, go ahead. Go ahead. Oh my God, oh my God, I am sorry with all my heart for doing wrong. I love you and do not want to sin again. You are all good and deserving of all my love. I will try with your help to sin no more. Amen. 